G'day, it's Sam Buchanan. Today I want to dispel the myth that cash is king when buying a home. A lot of people assume that if I've got 100% cash, then I'm a better offer, I'm a better buyer, I can pay less or I can demand more, I guess, things in my favor. So it's actually not the case. So if you're a buyer and you've got pre-approved finance from the bank, then you're just as good as a buyer who's got the cash sitting in their own personal account versus taking it from the bank's account. And the reason being is when you're pre-approved, the money's guaranteed. So what actually gives a better offer overall comes down to the seller's situations and their circumstance and also yours as a buyer too. So to give you an idea, if a seller hasn't bought their own home yet, they may want to stay back with a delayed settlement, you know, 60 or 90 days versus saying, I've got to take the 30 days or the 28 days because the person's paying cash and they, you know, they think it's a better thing, but it might not be. So in quite a few scenarios, including one right now, I'm dealing with a client who is trying to take a short settlement, offer 100% cash, but the buyer, the sellers haven't bought a home yet. So if they take the quicker settlement, they're going to be out sooner. So in actual fact, a seller might take five grand less, for example, to get the settlement they need or the terms or the conditions that they need that better suits them. Um, in this situation, we're looking at having a standard settlement but a lease back option, which means they've got the money in their account, they can um, lease back, stay in the home that they're at, and therefore they can buy a home as soon as it becomes available that they like. So a uh, bit of a quick finance tip, um, cash isn't king, um, it can be, and the only time it is is when the offers are identical or very, very similar. And that's the time when if price is similar, settlement similar, exchange terms are similar, um, any conditions or the offer that is subject to is similar, then yeah, you'd go for the cash offer as well. But in actual fact, it puts you in a better position as a buyer to have cash when things are equal. But as soon as someone's offering five or 10 grand more or better situations and terms, cash ain't king. So enjoy the rest of your day. Look, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a share to friends and family. Give it a like for me. And if you are thinking of selling, check, um, check out my website, sambuchanan.com. You can download a book for free. There's no need to put an email address in. And that's my uh, No BS book. It's got my um, history on a page or pages. And uh, you can get a good understanding as to what makes me tick and how you profit from my knowledge. I'll uh, chat to you soon. Enjoy. Take care.